see that finger? Yeah. Can you see that? You see how big that knuckle is? Yeah. You know, I did that wrestling. And you know why it's like that? Because, because back in the day, if you didn't wrestle, you didn't get paid. So I couldn't take it and have it done and have, you know, have that brace on it because you poke the guy's eye out. Plus, it'd get hit all the time, too. So I just, what I ended up doing was taping the two fingers together and uh, just, and it, that's what it's done over the year. And I did that. What had happened, me and Roddy Piper, my cousin Johnny was coming back from Columbus, Ohio to Atlanta. And we're coming up the escalator. This guy in front of me started getting really smart, saying something. We ain't even said nothing to him, you know. Um, and he turned around, got like toward my face when I pushed him. He fell down on the escalator. Well, we was at the top, so he jumped up and got off. Well, we got off. He went this way. We went that way. We're walking across the airport. All of a sudden, my, I go, oh, my God. He had took and threw a rock across the airport and hit me in my knuckle. Hit me in my knuckle. And I, I thought, what the heck? And uh, so anyway, it was broke. It was broke. And so in a few minutes, we could, well, oh no, we turned around and chased his ass down is what we did. I shoved him down. His keys fell out. My cousin Johnny took throwed his keys, throwed his keys. So we're going back across the airport again. All of a sudden, I guess he threw another rock, but it hit that big metal conveyor belt. The bags come in, sound like a shotgun or something. Cannon. Anyway, there were two cops there, and they said, what was that? Guy over there just threw a rock. Boy, they took off over that way. We took <laughs> off running out the door. So, yeah, yeah. But it was, it was crazy, man. man so what is, what's going on there? So is it is it all calcified now? I mean, can you get an operation to file it down now, or, or, or what's the score with it? Well, it, I guess I could go to the doctor, you know, and I guess I can do something about it. But, it, you know, I've had it's been like that so doggone long. It don't bother me no more. No. You know? <laughs> 